Tonka Fund is always looking for new producers and caregivers to partner with. The main thing that we look at is their uh, desire and their passion for um, working with buffalo. Some of our projects have been raising buffalo for 30 plus years and still struggling to get by. They don't do it for the finances. They do it for the passion that they have for the land. You must be a native uh, or tribally enrolled. Land is a huge issue in, in Indian country. It takes anywhere from 20 to 40 acres to sustain one animal, a thousand pound animal, for a year. So when you're talking about, you know, 10 buffalo, 50 buffalo, multiply that by 20, 30, 40 acres and you're talking large landscapes. What resources do you have at hand? Financing, a conservation plan, a business plan is very important to becoming and creating a sustainable operation. Looking at those pieces alone will help us advance forward in this process to see if it's a good fit for Tonka Fund and you as a partner with us. All the projects that we work with, they're all very conservation-minded. The soils, the grasses, the trees are all very conscious, not only about the health of the land, but the health of the animals, making sure that they have adequate food and water. Sometimes it's tricky, particularly when we are in drought situations. So we try to help them with that piece as well, is to make sure that uh, emergency funding is available, if there's any kind of disaster. What are your conservation goals? What do you hope to bring? Because we are a native owned organization, the other piece that we look at is longevity, that this is gonna be passed down from generation to generation. Working with producers and walking with them on their land and looking at the buffalo and seeing the actual beauty and energy that is here on the land, it's amazing. It's one of the most beautiful sights in the world. It brings passion to the heart. These producers are not only regenerating the land, they're bringing back the buffalo across the landscape and revitalizing our people and our communities. We're really digging into what they need to be successful um, at raising buffalo.